Oh, my lips would be feeling dry. Listen, you guys, but this time I'm actually going to take you guys to the different floors. In today's video, we're currently in Sterling. I'm gonna showcase a three bedroom townhouse by Alan Water Homes. And the particular development is in Canvas Barn. So this location is actually 25 minutes from Glasgow and also it's close to good links to Falkirk and all around. So geographically, it's actually really good. And the townhouses, they're a one-off by Allen Water Homes. So the property we're gonna showcase today is the Devron 2. So the property actually comprises of three floors and each floor is you get the entire floor and it's very spacious. You get a lot of room, it's 1,300 square feet. So you get a lot of house for the price. So the Devron 2 is actually going for only 299,000. I mean, guys, for what you see in their property, it's definitely worth the money. So the mills behind me has got a lot of history. So it's built in the 19th century and they've recently been converted into apartments and Allen Waters on this particular site, they've actually built townhouses around it. And what's really good about it is that they've actually kept to the same standard. So the brickwork, etc., of the townhouses are the same as basically the mills. So that's really nice, keeping that heritage and keeping that history alive. All the details on this particular property and the development are actually linked in the description box below. So if you guys want to know more, make sure you read that and also get in touch. So I'll now take you guys into the Devon too. So. So as you enter from the front door, you're actually greeted with a lot of space. And on this floor, this is the kitchen slash the family area. So as you can see, the kitchen is a very decent size. In fact, the whole floor, there's a lot of space. I mean, I'll let you guys take in some of the space as Kay says. Let you guys take in some of the space and the room. But basically what you have is a lot of storage. I mean, from here, you've got your integrated fridge and freezer which is, allows you to store quite a lot of things in it and a lot of shelves, so which is really good. And you've got plenty of other storage. You've got your electric hob and you've also got your extraction fan. Um, you've got your oven and then you've got plenty of storage. So you've got the integrated microwave and also you've got some under storage, plenty of storage under the sink and you've got your integrated dishwasher. So you've got this breakfast bar, which again, gives you a lot of space. You've got enough space that you can fit. Those are three big um, bar stools or bar chairs, but you could probably fit a fourth one as well. And even some here. So you can get, if you've got people over, guests over, you're hosting a party or you're just hosting, you get a lot of people around here while you're doing what you're doing which is good. And then in this part, because we're in the sales, this is effectively the sales office. So they've set it up. This is um, set it up as an office. But what you can do with this space is, I mean, I would get a TV here, a little couch there, so you can watch your TV. And also behind this, you've also got some extra space here, which is really good. I mean, they've got it, again, set it up as the sales office. And looking at it from a different angle, you can see, how big the space is you can even get a dining table in this spot you know if you want to just have a family meal or again if you have guests over you just all want to eat then there's plenty of space for it and here you've got some storage which is you can use that as storage but it's also got your electrics and what's really good about this is they've got solar panels uh, on this townhouse and you can see the solar panel box there given all the readings but why that is really good is you can actually save a lot of money on uh, 
power, utilities, um, electricity, and all of that that you're using. So we're now gonna go to the different floors, but first of all, through this door, you actually get to the hallway, and the door straight ahead is actually the leads to the back, which from the back, that's where a lot of the parking spaces are, and you're allocated one designated parking space. This hallway is actually really big, and look at the flooring, they've got really luxury looking floors. So in there, you've got some storage, and that's also where the boiler is, and every floor has a, um, a lot of storage within it. So in this room to my right is the utility slash the downstairs toilet. So as we enter the utility slash downstairs toilet, I mean, there's a lot of room just for a downstairs toilet. This is a two piece. So you get your toilet and you get your sink on one side and then the windows here, the fact there's two windows, which is again, letting a lot, a lot of light and they've got a really nice um, blinds here. And they've got this, which is pretty cool. It's like a, a cover, a shield. So it's actually quite nice. It's different, you know, but really nice. And to my right here, this is the utility part of it. So in there, they've got a storage that you can put like your clothes, you can put anything that needs to be washed, your laundry, etc. You can go in there. So you can actually get, they've got a pipe in here so you can actually fit your washing machine and tumble dryer. So you've got, you can actually use this as your actual designated laundry room, which is nice because it's isolated away. It's tucked away and it's tucked away where this, within this toilet as well. So it's really nice. You wouldn't notice it wouldn't get in the way or anything like that. So it's good. And also when things are running, it, it won't be noisy because the, the noise will be isolated within that room. So there's three floors within this townhouse and there's two uh, control systems. So they've got one control system controlling the heat from this floor and the middle floor. And there's another control system for the top floor. This floor can be heated, etc. And then the upstairs, you're not wasting the energy. And what's good about this townhouse is that, let's say you heat here because the heat rises, if you switch on the heat in here, likely the top floors will get heated as well. So you're containing all that heat within uh, the different floors, which is actually a very unique design of townhouses and in particular this one. Before we go upstairs, I'll show you guys outside, out the back actually. So you get quite a lot of space for your back garden. And what they do, Alan Waters Homes, is they actually put grass in for you all the tough. So you don't need to do that yourself and they pave all this leading to your back gate and outside beyond the gate is your designated parking space so that's all really good actually and also what they also do is that they include a six foot fence for either side of which is not something builders normally do it's really good because you don't want to start you move in and you start trying to negotiate things with your neighbors like hey oga make with they get six foot fence nah you already get your foot, six foot fence did so we're gonna go back into the house and then start taking you guys through the different floors i know i keep promising you guys but this time i'm actually going to take you guys to the different floors so now I'll take you guys upstairs so as you go upstairs and um, the stairs spiral a little which is nice they've carpeted the floor and what you see is basically what you get with these houses everything in that you're seeing comes as standard um, in these townhouses. We're now on the first floor and you can see there's room for stairs for the next floor but on my left is one of the three bedrooms and just in front of me as we're going in is actually the lounging area and guys look at this plenty of space very nice carpets this is like a formal lounge so if you've got guests Plenty of guests, you can have some downstairs in the kitchen, you can have some up here just chilling. I mean, they've got this three seater, so it's enough. And they've got some furniture there and also a little chair there. If you guys wanna just sit and have a chat or you guys wanna watch a movie or family, family movie night, all of that, this is really nice. And also the acoustics of this room, I mean, you can hear it, it's really nice, very dry, very quiet which is really nice, it's a good selling point of the house. I mean, that alone 
because I like peace and quiet. That alone would make me want to buy this house. <laughs> All right. So to my left is actually one of the three bedrooms. And this bedroom is one of the two that have en suites. So this is a double bedroom and a lot of space. I mean, that bed is a double bed, but you can see all the space in and around the bed. And they've got a window, the three style window with the huge window at the bottom. I mean, that's unique, that's really nice. Just to let in maximum uh, light in for days like this where the sun is actually shining for a change. It's nice to get that sunshine in. And also what um, this property and uh, Alan Waters Homes do actually is all of the rooms have got fitted wardrobes, which a lot of builders don't actually do. You usually get maybe just a master bedroom that has fitted wardrobes. But this one, all of the bedrooms have fitted wardrobes. So you can be assured that there's plenty of storage space. Uh, even within um, the wardrobe, there's a lot of space that you can hang your suits, dresses, and you've got some storage at the top that you can just store things, which which is really, really nice. And that's what you need. Um, that's what you need in the house. You want spaces that you can put things in and tuck things away and things are not just lying everywhere. So now on my left side is the ensuite of this room. So you enter the ensuite, it's pretty big for an ensuite. I mean, you get your three piece, you get your shower unit, and then you also get your toilet and your sink. But there's a lot of space that you get within this. I mean, the side of that, they've got the towel rack, they've got everything, the rack for everything, which is pretty good. Uh, keeps everything in one space. And also you've got the windows, they've got, a, pretty much a long window which is nice from ceiling to floor which is actually qu pretty cool lets in a lot of light i'll show you guys upstairs to the second floor which has two bedrooms and the family bathroom so as you're coming up again it's, it's spiraled so spirals to the left and now you're on a much bigger landing and to my left there you've got the family bathroom which is a three-piece family bathroom to my other left, you've got one of the three bedrooms and straight in front of me, you've got the, the third bedroom. The second of the bedrooms with the ensuite. So it's the second of the three bedrooms, but two have ensuites. And as you can see, it's massive, you know, again, I'm not sure which is bigger, this or the other one, but I would say this one is bigger just because it seems like there's more in it. But yeah. So you've got a double bed and as you can see, there's plenty of space around it. You've got a radiator here. Even though the room is big, it still feels intimate in this a small sense. So it'll be very good to retain heat. And you've got like these large windows, basically a Juliet, Juliet balcony. And they've got a little area for sitting. So if you had the right idea, you just sit down, look out the window and then whatever you want to do while you're looking out the window, contemplate on some ish, but yeah, it's really nice. And these open up, I'm not sure how they would open up, but I think they open up. You can let in a lot of air in on days like this where it's nice, get a lot of light, get that breeze. Just outside, there's a lot of trees around, so you definitely get a nice breeze. All the rooms have um, wardrobes, so with plenty of space. And just like the other room, You've got a lot of space. You can have either side, his and hers, and then his and hers, you need to fight it out who gets the top space or whatever they get. But yeah, plenty of storage space. And the doors actually feel, they feel very heavy and feel really nice, good quality. And also what I didn't mention or forgot to mention was the doors to each of the rooms. They are actually fire doors because it's a townhouse. If anything happened, God forbid, you'd want to, isolate the fire downstairs so they're very heavy very good quality very nice doors and in here you've got the ensuite which again is very big size three piece you've got your shower unit you've got the full height tiles in the shower and also you've got the half height tiles but you've just got a little tile splash back on the sink which is nice you've got your toilet you've got plenty of storage within here that you can put things you can put a towel rack you can put all sorts so it's really nice so now i'll show you guys the third of the three bedrooms but this bedroom doesn't have an ensuite and um, but still really good size so 
and then after that we'll show you guys the family bathroom so as you go in you can see plenty of space in and around the bed so you get a lot of space with in this bedroom and you've got a two windows large style windows so it lets in plenty of light in and also on a day like this where it's quite breezy but it's sunny at the same time so you can open the windows get that breeze get that light in and just chill you know so like the rest of the bedrooms this one also has fitted wardrobes with plenty of storage in the wardrobe as well so all of the rooms like mentioned they've all got wardrobes in which is quite nice and it's a good way to basically have storage put things away keeps everything else neat and the size of the storage is actually pretty big so you could get quite a lot in in within it so it's really nice and the wallpaper the way they've decorated this room is nice everything goes well it's fairly neutral although they've got different colors um, in each but it still feels quite neutral Alright, so now I'll show you guys the family bathroom, um, which is also on this floor. And as you go in, you've got the family bathroom, which is a three piece. It's got a bathtub, unlike the other en suites that had shower units. So it'd be nice to have a candlelit bath or just a relaxing bath. You've also got your sink and you've got your toilet and you've got a giant mirror as well. So this bathtub's half height tiles which is quite nice actually so for the splashing you don't want to get this water on the walls and ruins the paint over time so that's nice to have those tiles and lastly on this floor you've actually got storage so the storage again they've used this storage for like towels for like the bathroom but you can use it however you want and it's quite nice that they've got you can see that the doors are heavy they just close themselves which is quite good and they've carpeted it so you can basically store it how you want the shelves or you can just have stacking things up but just need to watch out for the pipes so guys i hope you enjoyed this tour of this beautiful three bedroom townhouse by allen water homes this particular uh, plot is called the devon 2 so if you enjoy this content make sure you guys like subscribe so you don't miss any further uploads and also liking it lets us know that you enjoy this content and it makes us really excited to bring out more content for you guys comment below let us know the, your favorite feature of the house anything about this house let us know or even anything you guys want to know any burning questions you guys want to know about the house the development the developer the site around and of course we'll showcase some other great parts of sterling you know it's a really great city to be in but yeah let us know in the comments below and if you're looking to buy this property we've got all the details in the description box below and also if you're looking to sell any properties get in touch we'll help you we've got good connections we can get you guys good rates and also the same with buying but yeah check out the description box below guys thanks again for watching we'll see you in the next one peace love and bye <laughs> oh my lips would be feeling dry